Brain scientist Jill Bolte Taylor is one fiberglass brain away from launching her community art project in Bloomington. In 1996, she suffered a stroke. It inspired her to write a book and now get behind a project to put at least a dozen brains on display around Bloomington. Well, you say brains to somebody and you have one of two responses. They go, Ugh, or they go, oh. I want more people to go, oh, I want them to understand and appreciate this beautiful thing so that they'll protect theirs and they'll take care of it and they'll nurture it and we'll celebrate what are we as a human being. Organizations that pay to sponsor one of the five feet tall anatomically correct brains will get to decorate and paint them how they choose. The brains will be installed around Bloomington and IU's campus beginning in May. Right now, 11 sponsors have signed on to the project and there must be at least 12 to get the project off the ground.